Last year's MEAC tournament turned out to be an unpleasant surprise for almost everyone watching here in Hampton Roads. Not one, but both of our local teams suffered early exits. As the saying goes, there's always next year. Well, next year is now. Nathan Epstein has the scoop on Norfolk State and Hampton basketball. Last year's MEAC tournament is one the fans in Hampton Roads would probably rather forget. Guys that uh, played last year, they only played one game in the uh, MEAC tournament. Norfolk State undefeated, 16-0 in conference over the regular season. <laughs> eliminated by one point in the quarterfinal round. And it was like one game when we done. Then there's Hampton, the three seed a season ago. Ousted in the quarterfinals, also their first game of the tournament. Last year, it was a lot of those guys' first experience being there. So, you know, even if we lost, on, it was a last second shot, we still lost. Flash forward to this year. Our focus was really great at the beginning. Our intensity was, was great at the beginning. Then 2013 almost repeated itself. Four seed Norfolk State stormed out to a 17 point lead over Maryland Eastern Shore but only won by four to advance. I mean, maybe we used too much energy at the beginning. We were too pumped up. Any win, whether it's a half a point, four points, six points, 30 points, we'll take it at, at this point. You know, we got that game away early. You know, we get time to regroup, recollect ourselves. Now it's Hampton's turn to try and turn the tide of 2013 and hold serve at scope. You know, I think the guys are coming in, you know, feeling like, you know, not Let's get to the first night and see where it goes. They anxious to get in the tournament and show everybody that they're different. And their first chance to prove that comes Wednesday at 6 o'clock. At the MEAC tournament, this is Nathan Epstein for the Sports Wrap.